trap. No. <laughs> yeah. Hey, girlfriend. Cool. Yeah. So tomorrow, most likely, we'll be helping. Uh, catch up. Yep. Basically, doing everything that we just did again, but for MA. Except for you know, there'd be three of us, so it would help out faster. Yeah, that would be a lot stronger too, right? Yeah. Like fighting that. Night, uh, dark night again. Yep. The only one we can't really help her with would be the dragon. I don't know. Because it's hard to dodge that fire breath without a horse. Uh, don't do that. We'll do a work, and if you die, you can get us Ah, yeah, yes. That could potentially work. But you get to do the same thing. Just because she's, uh, faith bait, she might not be able to do that as we do. Hmm. That's bad style, right? Yeah, but that's, a, that's the one thing that does suck, though. I keep on, uh, like, before I use my spell, I go out there, I always do my ninja, my, well, my samurai attacks, and every time I do that, I use my, uh, all my magic, so that I can't use it. So it kind of wrecks the point. Like, I, usually I don't have enough energy after that, and I'm like, oh, well, shit, um... Can't heal ya. Because I definitely think my, sla my death slash is actually worth it. Oh yeah. At least when I do it, I actually hit like, uh, when we were doing fighting that uh, Dark Knight, it's the only way I can hit him that actually does damage to him instead of just the horse. True. But if I just did my normal slashes, I'd been just hitting the horse the whole time and we'd be not getting anywhere with it. It's like save save my slashes for a heal or you know, do major damage with my blade. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I definitely need another katana though. Well, it's because I want to turn my katana into a sacred, uh, like have a second katana with it, have the sacred ability on it so it can start throwing blades. I don't want to do it to this katana because apparently it turns my katana into a, a faith katana, which then I would have to upgrade my faith to make it more stronger. Which I don't want to do that. I'm basing my katana off of decks. <sighs> also, you know those uh, stupid golem things you hate so much? Yes. The uh, fucking, mm -hmm. what is it called? Imps? They do, uh, their drops revolve dropping their weapon and dropping those, you know, shards that help upgrade your weapon. That's the mine. Don't need them. Yeah, but did you know they actually have another actually super rare drop? They do that? Yep. I, I didn't know about it until I recently read up on them. I'm like, oh, sweet. Now I'm trying to camp it for that secret item. It, it pissed you off, though. You get the you get their helmet so you can look like a goblin. I would fucking find you and I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seriously just trying to kill them so I can get one of those. <laughs> so next time you see me, I'll be wearing a goblin helmet that you hate so much. You 
<laughs> you purposely go out just to buy a bunch of invade stones to invade me to constantly kill me. It's like, you're gonna die, why? I'm an imp. I need the helmet. I will keep killing these two until I get one. Or until I get enough shreds to upgrade my scythe. Or my uh, katana, either or. Because like I said, apparently it's like an extreme rare drop. I, I've killed them so far about 18 times. Still dropped nothing. No drops yet. Here comes number 19, number 20. Anything? First one, nothing. Second one? Nothing. Jesus. Yeah. I just want the freaking helmet. Like, I don't even know, like, how good the helmet is. I just want it. Let's see what it looks like. Double kill. And still nothing. Jesus. Uh, 22 dead. Goblin killing. Trying to get a rare drop. And still nothing. <laughs> Who knows? It might not even be worth it. Mm. But getting those shards to upgrade my freaking sword might be worth it, so. Maybe I'll go to the next new head weeping place for a bit. Huh? Oh, you're you thinking go the south uh, south area? Yeah, they got deep into one of the castles. Huh? Just came back as you guys all uh, summoned me. Fair. I was still debating where to go after I destroy all this normal land. Because we still have a lot to, like, we just unlocked the map for the forest, which we can attempt to find bosses around there, too. Yeah. Wee. Nice. Fly? I don't know. Oh, nice. Oh, of course I'm about to wait for him to win. Suck you. They almost killed me that time. You got blood lost on me. Wow, that, uh... That double jump is... Is that part of him? Pretty awesome. Yep. So I said, I just journeyed around the world, <laughs> just double jumping everywhere. That's why I uncovered a bunch of the maps. Uh, so far, I've killed at least 30 of them, still nothing. It's sad, I'm not even getting the fucking shards. I was hoping at least to get some fucking. Guess they must have just really, very, just. Small drop rate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, both dead again. Go back to sec. Alright.
Nope, still nothing. Try one more time. Oh, they finally dropped something. God damn it was their weapon. So out of what, like 35 times, they finally pulled their weapon. Which just, mean, it just means that it's my third time getting that weapon. leads all the way down there. I don't know why you're not on horseback, though. No, that's faster. I'm only confused as where Ninja Dave is. The only reason why is because I remember him telling me yesterday. Er, yesterday he's like, oh, I have today off. So I was thinking to myself, oh, he's probably going to be playing this a lot. Apparently not. Yeah, that's not something you want to fight. So I say save your magic. I'm gonna get to a site anyways. True. Join you if you want. Okay. Yes, and Dave's not on. Not right now, no. Though I should be strong enough to take care of these.
of that motion. Oh, you dropped Smith in there? Goddamn. Oh. Hit that guy with magic. The one that's looking. No, not the one that's not looking. Ah. At least now I know that you. Yeah, some of that takes me eight hits to hit. You take out two. So yeah, you can definitely take out them faster. I can almost do it. I can almost take them out in one hit if I just had one more level. To your left. Oh wait. I forget, is this the elevator? Yeah, never mind. That way first. Don't no. Oh. I say don't waste your magic, but okay. I got this. It's rats. Yeah, rats. I think that was it. I know. This is kind of why I wanted to bring you here. Because they're all weak against magic. Make hey, note of that for now. Oh, wrong way. Like, dead end? Don't worry about the dog. Worry about the other guy to the right. He's weak against magic, at least. What the hell? What the hell? Piece of shit, dogs. Secret news that's actually the true pathway. <laughs> yeah, we gotta roll off of it. Right. What? Wait, what? I've seen a pathway. I've seen a pathway right here, though. What's this? One second. Oh, no, that was just a dead end. My bad. Okay. One more time. We'll roll off this way. That's where I'm at. Oh. oh, Jesus. Apparently Ninja Dave's level 37 now. Was the wrong way to fight. I don't see anything here. Do I have any potions back? No, I'm still out. <sighs> oh, nice. I didn't even find one of those. Thank you. 
No. Right there, see that room? That's the boss room. Oh, but I don't have enough magic. There should be some items over here. Sometimes. I... Huh? A smithing stone. Oh. Yeah, it never showed up in my world. Sadly. And I don't really have that much health either. Yeah, I feel like we should go back through here. But, um... Skip the bottom area. That's true. And just go straight to here. Yep. And me not use my magic. I'm only using my magic on the guys and don't hit them until I them. Well, I get a free backstab on them. Might as well let me do free backstab. No, because then they go down. Just let me hit them once and then they're gone to like no health. You just hit them once and they're dead. Mm. Oh yeah, I forgot. What? Remember, we, we rolled off of this. So... Did you jump? Ah, you'll die. Oh. Okay, right here, safe. Here. Yep. And then roll off this way again. See, if you would have fell straight down, you would have died instantly. You have to figure out a way to come down safely. Oh, wrong way. We're on the bottom floor. Yeah, we're supposed to go back up. Oh, we need the lever. Yep. <laughs> It's one of the levers that I can actually pull. I was gonna say, no, you gotta summon me anyway. What? 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 You can't rest because I'm here. So. You just made your attack stronger. Yeah. I'll see if I can kill one shot now. Maybe. This time, aim for the one that's standing first. He's gonna throw things. So he, the other guy that's sitting is not gonna pay attention right now. Oh. Ow. You literally just have to deal the final blow. Yeah, this way. We can ignore all the enemies on that side. Feels more like a uh, secret path, but it's still legit. Okay, aim for the guy that's on the ground. Aim 
for the guy to the right. You want to make this fast, though. He throws fire. No, it keeps respawning. Are you serious? This is a mine that respawns. So I get smithing stones constantly? Yes. Ah, uh, that's ridiculous. Yep. Stay away from 100%. In D&D, these enemies are classified as trolls. Right, yeah. Right. I have all my heal potions, so it's good for me. You gotta go in first. Try to distract him as much as I can. Yeah, that's not going to help you right now, anyway. Right. Basic. Yeah. No, nope, that was it. All right. That teleports you back on top. Yeah, if you're wondering what the Roar Medallion is, is you equipped it, it boosts the uh, attack of your spells that you blow. Oh. So basically, if you killed that dragon and learnt Fire Breath, that would increase its attack of that Fire Breath. Which you don't. Which you don't have. So, yeah. We killed one of the bosses that, uh. Yeah. The only boss now. Uh, there's still a couple more. So, right here is the dragon. But if you go around the bridge, underneath the bridge, there's a. And if you keep going, under, this is where you helped me get that one, and I never went in yet. Remember? We uh, fell from here, went right here. We came this way, and it's like, tough of enemy up ahead. And we're like, yeah, no. So then we went over here, killed the skeletons and the blobs. And, but is there a tough enemy in there? Uh, an invader shows up here. Okay, but I can get to the cave before there. No, as soon as you're about to enter the cave, the invader shows up, preventing you from going into that cave. So you can summon me before you go into that cave. Yeah. So you want me to meet me over there? Well, well, you can just summon me outside this cave right here. Yeah, I'm coming up just two seconds. I want to rest at a place thing though first. Oh, why didn't you rest the one inside there? Gone. No, it's downstairs. You had to go down the elevator. The elevator was gone, is what I'm saying. Oh, there's a lever. I know that. I was about to do that, and you were like, oh, you can just summon me outside. And I'm like, but I don't want to do the thing. Then do the thing. I'll put my name right here on this rock. Just right outside the uh, cave.
on top of that rock. Oh yeah, you still gotta activate again because we beat a boss. Yep. Like I said, I don't think I will be able to help you beat the dragon, but... Yeah. Ninja Dave's gonna give me the staff to give to you later on. Oh, this is not going on uh, he's got D&D until &D 10 tonight. Ah. Yeah, that's the reason why I told you to keep your magic. That thing pops up from the ground. You just so happened you didn't aggro it last time. Crap, still falling. Oh, crap. Keep going. We're, he we're heading to basically underneath the bridge. Though we got a small little fight we gotta deal with before we go there. Okay. It's right underneath the bridge right here. You know what it is? The army of the undead. Skeletons. Remember, you gotta kill them twice. Once they go down on the ground, you have to hit them another time. Two more to go. Oh, I forgot this one has a crossbow. Oh, something must have fell on the other side of the bridge. I got like two arrows in me. Ah. It's only a flush one. No, but this freaking guy we're about to face. Be warned. Ninja Dave tried taking on alone. Got slaughtered. Ah. But then me and him fought it together and it was like a piece of cake. Because he also can heal. He's got potions too. He's also the one that drops that sh a cool knife I showed you. So, as soon as you're about to enter the cave, you're gonna... There you go, invaded. He's right there. Oh, she killed me. I just said that he heals. If you can keep on keep him at bay for a little bit longer, you should be saved. See that guy behind him? He's coming to save you. Yeah, me and Ninja Dave always just so happen to kill him before that guy shows up to help. He does run out of potions though, eventually. You can kill him before he uses them all, 